I hope you understand from part one of this lesson that a straight line 90 degree we show it with this symbol also okay with this one also we can measure if our line is on this side and the second one straight above that is equal to 90 degree if less than 90 0 10 20 that is acute and if more than 90 100 110 120 that is obtuse okay so we have three types of angles right angle acute angle and obtuse angle equal to 90 less than 90 more than 90 okay now let us go down here you see this one we can see the right angle by this symbol also very clear but if you put your protector the your end point let me show you again here this and that end point here and the line this line here okay so you will see that the straight one is 90 degrees so we call it what right angle okay and this one again we have to put to to find this angle we have to put our D in opposite way okay in this way right so we will see that it is more than 90 okay so it is obtuse angle let us move down here the same thing again here you will put your D and end point in the middle here this one okay and this line on this one here and you will see it is little bit more than 90 they told you here 94 so it is an obtuse angle you will write it 94 and a small circle above it degree for degree okay this one very clear that the line is so closer to the baseline so it is acute angle okay let us move to the next page here from the turn guys we move the circle half okay so half turn okay and from this D shaped ruler you guys know that a half there are total 360 degrees in a circle okay and in the half circle there are what 180 degrees 180 degrees okay so that's why we write that this one is 180 degree or we can call it half turn and from this one you know that when it is a straight line that is equal to 90 degree and this one is one fourth turn in the start of the part one video I told you guys about this okay the same thing again here you guys know more if the straight line is like this okay if it is less it is acute it is more now so it is obtuse angle same one right angle more than 90 the 90 is a straight one more than 90 so obtuse very clear it is a small angle acute angle okay let us move down here you have to draw an example of each figure any acute angle okay let me draw it for you here let's say you draw a line like this and the other one like this so this angle the 90 is straight okay so this one is less than 90 acute and obtuse a baseline like this okay and if the straight is 90 you can draw angle like this more than 90 so this is an obtuse angle I hope you understand let me clear the screen so you guys know more better about it okay an angle that measure 30 degree turns of course that is 31 degree angle actually it is 30 degree but the way of saying it 30 one degree angle okay classify the angle in exercise 11 of course if it is 30 it means it is less than 90 degrees so it is an acute angle an angle that measure 100 turns so 101 degree angle or you can write these two both in another way let me write it for you here like this 30 and a small circle above it this one 100 and 
a small circle above it which is representing degree okay let us move down of course if it is 100 more than 90 it means what obtuse more than 90 that is obtuse okay let us move to the last page here you can see this is half circle half and in half circle you know that there are 180 degrees and half turn okay now this angle the straight line if it is a straight it is 90 okay it is starting from here and moving more than 90 so it is of course obtuse I hope you guys understand the lesson and don't forget to subscribe my channel learn math with mr. Saad and also finish your homework and thank you so much guys have a nice day